Nigeria's economic history since independence could at best be described as a work in progress. From decades of military rule to the few years of civilian democracy, the economy and the subsets of business, investments and markets have failed to lift many out of poverty, create wealth and improve the basic living standards. Today, Nigeria is much bigger by population and by economic size. However, the country is yet troubled by old issues of weak political governance structures while battling challenges of a modern world like terrorism, illicit financial flows, globalization and food insecurity. The critical thing for me, I call it development intelligence. Now, development intelligence means governments at the federal, state and local we go out deliberately, identify private operators in priority sectors, and go after them and make them offers of incentives to come produce in their own jurisdiction. In which case, federal government is looking after Nigeria as a nation. Then every state government, and this is where some of us are also disappointed with our state governments, because the question was asked, how many of them have come up with plans that align with ARGP? And it turned out that only four out of 36 plus the federal capital. As the number of years away from the 1960 independence increases, so also are the yearnings of a population dominated by youths whose discontent with the past is unheeding and in a hurry to grab a better and a prosperous 21st century. According to a new Gates Foundation report, young people are more optimistic about their future and the future of their country than older people. This level of optimism are highest in lower and middle income countries like Nigeria, the report says. So, there is so much to be done as the country ticks off yet another independence calendar in 2018. The government would have to take hard decisions and bold actions that are consistent over a period of time, tasking the leaders in critical areas of national life, like infrastructure. The demand for an improved and sustainable social economic future will continue to increase as Nigerians weigh the country's potentials, the promises and the deliverables. And if there is anything that the country's leaders do not have in abundance, it is time to deliver beyond the Independence Day rhetoric. Boston, Channel Television News.